so uh, here we have the last stages of the um, the ECU uh, for uh, four cylinder. Um, we just uh, refoed the top side with the surface mount, obviously, and uh, we placed all the through hole components, uh, such as the um, input diode, relay, headers, uh, and whatnot. And now it's time to put these um, these vets on uh, that control the ignition drivers. So let's uh, let's start off with a new board um, and tape it around that way there. And I also need some more parts. So I'm going to start off with this this shape here. I'll just uh, put five there, or however many come out. Okay. And um, I'll just make sure I got my tweezers on side. And now I'll just uh, quickly paste. Um, with uh, solder paste here, so I'm just uh, applying a reasonable amount because there's uh, quite a large pad on the surface area to cover, and I'll just quickly paste these here as well. And there we go. That may seem a bit too much, um, but what we what you you'll see what happens in a minute here. Um, so I'll just uh, quickly place these devices. They don't have to be straight um, because the self tension obviously pulls them into to position anyway. Um, there we go. Yeah. Sweet. Okay. So now we well, now these are placed, and now I'm going to just apply some hot air. Um, I'm going to just you can see that there, but it's going to just pull into place. I'm going to just heat up the bottom tab as well, and then move the air to the bottom and shift it around so I can see it's comfortably sitting and there you go, it's, it's firmly in place and then for the next one make sure the heat goes all around I'll just get the air to push it over a little bit and then third one there you go, that poured nicely into place fourth one and there we go, so they're all roughly in line as well and that's perfect. Okay, so now we've got to do the rest of them.